The most important sale of Irish artwork in three years goes under the hammer at Dublin's RDS on May 21st, when White's art auctioneers hold their important Irish art auction. The managing director of White's is Ian White. Yes, it's probably the most important sale this year. Uh, it uh, will, the, the gross value is in the region of about 1.5 to 2 million euro. Uh, if this sale was five years ago, with the same amount and the same uh, quality of material, we'd be looking at 3 to 4 million euro. So it's an incredibly important sale uh, and probably the most important in the last three years. One of the highlights of the auction will be the Thorn collection by the late Louis Le Brocchi. In that we have a, a, a number of great works by Louis Le Brocchi, including the complete set of the 20 tapestries for the Thorn series. Uh, all of these were consigned long before uh, Louis's unfortunate passing. Uh, however, it's opposite that they are uh, on, on, on exhibition at least at the moment, and in a way it's almost a memorial uh, exhibition to this great artist. The auction will feature most of the famous Irish artists from the past century. We have some wonderful collections. We've part of the Jim O'Driscoll collection, who was a famous uh, cork collector. He particularly collected contemporary Irish art, people like Bill Crozier, Tony O'Malley, John Shinners, and so on. Uh, wonderful pieces. Uh, we also have a wonderful collection of Grace Henry paintings uh, collected by uh, James Cruikshank over a period of about 30 years. We have all the big names, we have Jack Yates, we've got John, Sir John Lavery, wonderful Sean Keating, uh, Jerry Dillon, uh, Dan O'Neill, you name it, we've got it in this auction.